Ukrainian defenders tracked down and attacked Russian Grad MLRS, the Perun attack drone company of the 79th Separate Airborne Assault Brigade destroyed a Russian Grad MLRS near the village of Radensk in the temporarily occupied part of, of the Kherson region. This multiple rocket launcher system systematically shelled civilian objects in Kherson, whether used for reconnaissance, dropping bombs or self-exploding on impact, drones save money and soldiers' lives. They are also more precise than traditional artillery, which is in short supply and can deliver outsized impacts such as real-time mapping of the battlefield, destroying tanks and ships, and bringing Russian advances to a halt. The advantages of drones can be fleeting, however. Ukraine's Minister for Digital Transformation, Mykhailo Fedorov, says the government is committed to building a state-of-the-art army of drones and that its value to the war effort will be evident by the end of this year. The country has already trained more than 10,000 new drone pilots this year. The new stage of the war will soon begin, Fedorov promises. At present, Ukraine is training thousands of drone pilots and ramping up its production of unmanned aircraft to bring an army of drones to the front lines of the counter-offensive against Russia.